100 Civics Questions and Answers. Part 1. American Government. Section A. Principles of American Democracy. Question 1. What is the supreme law of the land? Answer. The Constitution. Question 2. What does the Constitution do? Answer. Sets up the government. Defines the government. Protects basic rights of Americans. Question 3. The idea of self-government is in the first three words of the Constitution. What are these words? Answer. We the people. Question 4. What is an amendment? Answer. A change to the Constitution. An addition to the Constitution. Question 5. What do we call the first ten amendments to the Constitution? Answer. The Bill of Rights. Question 6. What is one right or freedom from the First Amendment? Answer. Speech. Religion. Assembly. Press. Petition the government. Question 7. How many amendments does the Constitution have? Answer. 27. Question 8. What did the Declaration of Independence do? Answer. Announced our independence from Great Britain. Declared our independence from Great Britain. Said that the United States is free from Great Britain. Question 9. What are two rights in the Declaration of Independence? Answer. Life. Liberty. Pursuit of happiness. Question 10. What is freedom of religion? Answer. You can practice any religion, or not practice a religion. Question 11. What is the economic system in the United States? Answer. Capitalist economy. Market economy. Question 12. What is the rule of law? Answer. Everyone must follow the law. Leaders must obey the law. Government must obey the law. No one is above the law. Section B. System of Government. Question 13. Name one branch or part of the government. Answer. Congress. Legislative. President. Executive. The courts. Judicial. Question 14. What stops one branch of government from becoming too powerful? Answer. Checks and balances. Separation of powers. Question 15. Who is in charge of the executive branch? Answer. The president. Question 16. Who makes federal laws? Answer. Congress, Senate and House, of Representatives, U.S. or National, Legislature. Question 17. What are the two parts of the U.S. Congress? Answer. The Senate and House, of Representatives. Question 18. How many U.S. Senators are there? Answer. 100. Question 19. We elect a U.S. Senator for how many years? Answer. 6. Question 20. Who is one of your state's U.S. Senators now? Answer. Answers will vary. District of Columbia residents and residents of U.S. territories should answer that D.C., or the territory where the applicant lives, has no U.S. Senators. Question 21. The House of Representatives has how many voting members? Answer. 
435. Question 22. We elect a U.S. representative for how many years? Answer. 2. Question 23. Name your U.S. representative. Answer. Answers will vary. Residents of territories with non-voting delegates or resident commissioners may provide the name of that delegate or commissioner. Also acceptable is any statement that the territory has no voting representatives in Congress. Question 24. Who does a U.S. senator represent? Answer. All people of the state. Question 25. Why do some states have more representatives than other states? Answer. Because of the state's population. Because they have more people. Because some states have more people. Question 26. We elect a president for how many years? Answer. Four. Question 27. In what month do we vote for president? Answer. November. Question 28. What is the name of the president of the United States now? Answer. Joseph R. Biden Jr. Joe Biden. Biden. Question 29. What is the name of the vice president of the United States now? Answer. Kamala D. Harris. Kamala Harris. Harris. Question 30. If the president can no longer serve, who becomes president? Answer. The vice president. Question 31. If both the president and the vice president can no longer serve, who becomes president? Answer. The Speaker of the House. Question 32. Who is the Commander-in-Chief of the Military? Answer. The President. Question 33. Who signs bills to become laws? Answer. The President. Question 34. Who vetoes bills? Answer. The President. Question 35. What does the President's cabinet do? Answer. Advises the President. Question 36. What are two cabinet level positions? Answer. Attorney General, Secretary of Agriculture, Secretary of Commerce, Secretary of Defense. Secretary of Education, Secretary of Energy, Secretary of Health and Human Services, Secretary of Homeland Security, Secretary of Housing and Urban Development, Secretary of the Interior, Secretary of Labor, Secretary of State, Secretary of Transportation, Secretary of the Treasury, Secretary of Veterans Affairs, Vice President of the United States. Question 37. What does the judicial branch do? Answer. Reviews laws. Explains laws. Resolves disputes, disagreements. Decides if a law goes against the Constitution. Question 38. What is the highest court in the United States? Answer. The Supreme Court. Question 39. How many justices are on the Supreme Court? Answer. 9. Question 40. Who is the Chief Justice of the United States now? Answer. John Roberts. John G. Roberts, Jr. Question 41. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the federal government. What is one power of the federal government? Answer. To print money. To declare war. To create an army. To make treaties. 
Question 42. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the states. What is one power of the states? Answer. Provide schooling and education. Provide protection, police. Provide safety, fire departments. Give a driver's license. Approve zoning and land use. Question 43. Who is the governor of your state now? Answer. Answers will vary. District of Columbia residents should answer that D.C. does not have a governor. Question 44. What is the capital of your state? Answer. Answers will vary. District of Columbia residents should answer that D.C. is not a state and does not have a capital. Residents of U.S. territories should name the capital of the territory. Question 45. What are the two major political parties in the United States? Answer. Democratic and Republican. Question 46. What is the political party of the president now? Answer. Democratic Party. Question 47. What is the name of the Speaker of the House of Representatives now? Answer. Nancy Pelosi. Pelosi. Section C. Rights and Responsibilities. Question 48. There are four amendments to the Constitution about who can vote. Describe one of them. Answer. Citizens 18 and older can vote. You don't have to pay a poll tax to vote. Any citizen can vote. Women and men can vote. A male citizen of any race can vote. Question 49. What is one responsibility that is only for United States citizens? Answer. Serve on a jury. Vote in a federal election. Question 50. Name one right only for United States citizens. Answer. Vote in a federal election. Run for federal office. Question 51. What are two rights of everyone living in the United States? Answer. Freedom of expression. Freedom of speech. Freedom of assembly. Freedom to petition the government. Freedom of religion. The right to bear arms. Question 52. What do we show loyalty to when we say the Pledge of Allegiance? Answer. The United States. The flag. Question 53. What is one promise you make when you become a United States citizen? Answer. Give up loyalty to other countries. Defend the Constitution and laws of the United States. Obey the laws of the United States. Serve in the U.S. military, if needed. Serve, do important work for, the nation, if needed. Be loyal to the United States. Question 54. How old do citizens have to be to vote for president? Answer. 18 and older. Question 55. What are two ways that Americans can participate in their democracy? Answer. Vote. Join a political party. Help with a campaign. Join a civic group. Join a community group. Give an elected official your opinion on an issue. Call senators and representatives. Publicly support or oppose an issue or policy. Run for office. Write to a newspaper. Question 56. When is the last day you can send in federal income tax forms? Answer. April 15th. Question 57. When must all men register for the Selective Service? Answer. At age 18. Between 18 and 26. Part 2. American History. Section A. Colonial Period and Independence. 
Question 58. What is one reason colonists came to America? Answer. Freedom. Political liberty. Religious freedom. Economic opportunity. Practice their religion. Escape persecution. Question 59. Who lived in America before the Europeans arrived? Answer. American Indians. Native Americans. Question 60. What group of people was taken to America and sold as slaves? Answer. Africans. People from Africa. Question 61. Why did the colonists fight the British? Answer. Because of high taxes, taxation without representation. Because the British army stayed in their houses, boarding, quartering. Because they didn't have self-government. Question 62. Who wrote the Declaration of Independence? Answer. Thomas, Jefferson. Question 63. When was the Declaration of Independence adopted? Answer. July 4, 1776. Question 64. There were 13 original states. Name three. Answer. New Hampshire. Massachusetts. Rhode Island. Connecticut. New York. New Jersey. Pennsylvania. Delaware. Maryland. Virginia. North Carolina. South Carolina. Georgia. Question 65. What happened at the Constitutional Convention? Answer. The Constitution was written. The Founding Fathers wrote the Constitution. Question 66. When was the Constitution written? Answer. 1787. Question 67. The Federalist Papers supported the passage of the U.S. Constitution. Name one of the writers. Answer. James, Madison, Alexander, Hamilton, John, J. Publius. Question 68. What is one thing Benjamin Franklin is famous for? Answer. U.S. diplomat. Oldest member of the Constitutional Convention. First Postmaster General of the United States. Writer of Poor Richard's Almanac. Started the first free libraries. Question 69. Who is the father of our country? Answer. George Washington. Question 70. Who was the first president? Answer. George, Washington. Section B. 1800s. Question 71. What territory did the United States buy from France in 1803? Answer. The Louisiana Territory. Louisiana. Question 72. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1800s. Answer. War of 1812. Mexican-American War. Civil War. Spanish-American War. Question 73. Name the U.S. war between the North and the South. Answer. The Civil War. The war between the states. Question 74. Name one problem that led to the Civil War. Answer. Slavery. Economic reasons. States' rights. Question 75. What was one important thing that Abraham Lincoln did? Answer. Freed the slaves, Emancipation Proclamation. Saved, or preserved, the Union. Led the United States during the Civil War. Question 76. What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? 
Answer. Freed the slaves. Freed slaves in the Confederacy. Freed slaves in the Confederate states. Freed slaves in most southern states. Question 77. What did Susan B. Anthony do? Answer. Fought for women's rights. Fought for civil rights. Section C. Recent American history and other important historical information. Question 78. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1900s. Answer. World War I. World War II. Korean War. Vietnam War. Persian, Gulf War. Question 79. Who was president during World War I? Answer. Woodrow, Wilson. Question 80. Who was president during the Great Depression and World War II? Answer. Franklin, Roosevelt. Question 81. Who did the United States fight in World War II? Answer. Japan, Germany, and Italy. Question 82. Before he was president, Eisenhower was a general. What war was he in? Answer. World War II. Question 83. During the Cold War, what was the main concern of the United States? Answer. Communism. Question 84. What movement tried to end racial discrimination? Answer. Civil Rights Movement. Question 85. What did Martin Luther King Jr. do? Answer. Fought for civil rights. Worked for equality for all Americans. Question 86. What major event happened on September 11, 2001, in the United States? Answer. Terrorists attacked the United States. Question 87. Name one American Indian tribe in the United States. Answer. Cherokee. Navajo, Sioux, Chippewa, Choctaw, Pueblo, Apache, Iroquois, Creek, Blackfeet, Seminole, Cheyenne, Arawak, Shawnee, Mohegan, Huron, Oneida, Lakota, Crow, Teton, Hopi, Inuit. Part 3. Integrated Civics. Section A. Geography. Question 88. Name one of the two longest rivers in the United States. Answer. Missouri, River. Mississippi, River. Question 89. What ocean is on the west coast of the United States? Answer. Pacific, Ocean. Question 90. What ocean is on the east coast of the United States? Answer. Atlantic, Ocean. Question 91. Name one U.S. territory. Answer. Puerto Rico. U.S. Virgin Islands. American Samoa. Northern Mariana Islands. Guam. Question 92. Name one state that borders Canada. Answer. Maine. New Hampshire. Vermont. New York. Pennsylvania. Ohio. Michigan. Minnesota. North Dakota. Montana. Idaho. Washington. Alaska. Question 93. Name one state that borders Mexico. Answer. California. Arizona. 
New Mexico, Texas. Question 94. What is the capital of the United States? Answer. Washington, D.C. Question 95. Where is the Statue of Liberty? Answer. New York, Harbor, Liberty Island. Section B. Symbols. Question 96. Why does the flag have 13 stripes? Answer. Because there were 13 original colonies. Because the stripes represent the original colonies. Question 97. Why does the flag have 50 stars? Answer. Because there is one star for each state. Because each star represents a state. Because there are 50 states. Question 98. What is the name of the national anthem? Answer. The Star Spangled Banner. Section C. Holidays. Question 99. When do we celebrate Independence Day? Answer. July 4th. Question 100. Name two national U.S. holidays. Answer. New Year's Day. Martin Luther King Jr. Day. President's Day. Memorial Day. Independence Day. Labor Day. Columbus Day. Veterans Day. Thanksgiving. Christmas. Thank you for watching this video. We have another version specifically for your state. You can find the link in description below. If you like our work, please like, subscribe and share our channel. Good luck to your test.